Welcome to The Daily Dose. My name is Patricia Baranowski Schneider. I'm the CEO of Pristine Advisors, investor relations, public relations, media relations, and marketing firm with over three decades of experience working in a wide variety of niches across the globe. Today I'm going to continue on how you market yourself. Yesterday we spoke about determining who your target market is, how you can reach your target market. We also spoke about how you can convince customers to buy your product or services. Also, who your competitors were and how customers perceive your brand. We also spoke about how you can make your product and company more visible online. Well, today we're going to continue the question on how to best market yourself. So you want to know how are customers finding your business? To answer that question, you can create a pop-up advertisement on your website that asks customers where they found your business. You can also include this information as part of an optional step in creating an account, finalizing a purchase, or even after they placed an order. Consider typing your business's name online to determine the websites where it shows up. It's important to understand where your shoppers are finding your business because you can focus your marketing efforts in that location. Try to improve on or remove efforts where there's little to no customer traffic. Next, you want to know why your customers visiting your websites but not purchasing your product? Well, to avoid customers leaving digital carts full of items on your website, consider creating a customer journey map using a free template online. It's also helpful to include fun or interesting content and quality images on your website to maintain your customer's attention and increase session times, you know, attention spans. You can also try navigating your website and mobile app as if you were a shopper to make sure that the shopping experience is fast and simple. It can be beneficial to analyze competitor campaigns and pricing to gauge how your business compares. Consider charging less or offering discounts or benefits such as referral codes or free add-ons for certain purchases or to entice customers. Then, how do you create an effective marketing plan? To create an effective marketing plan, try to conduct a SWOT analysis that defines your strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. You can also identify specific measurable, attainable, relevant, and time-bound SMART goals while creating your marketing plan. After accomplishing this, try to write the methods you plan to employ to reach these goals while maintaining an established budget. Various tools such as marketing plan templates can help you organize your plan into an actionable set of steps and processes. For example, a marketing team that wants to increase, it to increase its monthly sales for the next year can create a marketing plan that highlights where to increase spending. You can achieve this by analyzing previous campaign results, monitoring budget, budgetary adherence, track completed benchmark, and accessing the brand's value. What should you do next? To answer this question, try to create a list of short and long-term goals. It's often essential to remain updated on current and emerging trends in your industry so you can tailor your content toward maintaining relevance. Enrolling in marketing business and industry-related classes to learn more about current trends within your field can ensure relevance and timeliness in your content. As the title of my post says, been there, done that. I can assure you that in my 35 years of working in the industry, I've done it all, and I've learned from many, many mistakes. I've learned so much and can help you to do what works best to get your story in front of the audience that matters. Contact me to learn about my story and how I can help you. You can find out more about me on my website at www.pristineadvisors.com, and that's A-D-B-I-S-E-R-S.com. You can email me at pbaronowski at pristineadvisors.com. You can reach me on my phone at 631-756-2486. Until next time, take care. Mm-hmm.